and there you go there's your thumbnail that you can use for your live stream how amazing it's little to no effort basically youtube it's ronnie mp whoop it's ronniemp.com want to join my free gift card giveaway subscribe to the channel like the video and turn on the notification then let me know that you subscribe down below that's it hey yo what's good youtube you know who it is it's your boy ronnie mp thank you and welcome to this brand new video this brand new it's not well it's not brand new channel but thank you and welcome to the video guys and in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how a lot of youtubers especially if you have a youtube account you can do this they are absolutely crushing it and making insane amounts of money um they're gaining subs by the day it's literally insane and the method and tip that they are using and this is going to be working for 2019 for basically from now to about maybe mid 2019 to the end of 2019 is live stream they are absolutely crushing it with live stream and i'm about to show you how so that you can be able to replicate this and hopefully have the same success that they are having uh, as well as myself I'm, i've been doing it now i'm going to be doing it on this um channel right now as an example for you guys so you guys can follow along so if for example if you use youtube a lot you might already know who pewdiepie is but if you don't know pewdiepie basically he's the biggest currently anyways he's the biggest youtuber um on the face of the planet he's got the most subscribers i think he's got like 72 million or something insane like that right now currently however there is a new channel that's well not new but there's a channel basically that's trying to beat him um and their t series so if for example let me type let's go into my computer right now jump in and i'll show you guys everything live because i don't want i don't want to feed you guys bs i want you guys to use things that are going to potentially make you guys insane amount of money that's why i'm here that's this is what we're doing right now so let's say for example let me just paste this title that i have i already knew it was paste there so follow along and you see what i'm talking about whoa so now <laughs> that is insane so right when i typed pewdiepie versus t-series which is the name of the channel that you know that they, they, they're basically looking like they're going to be beating not yet looking like they're going to be beating pewdiepie very soon which is this channel uh t-series versus pewdiepie so now funny enough people are actually super interested in watching this uh i do not know why people want to watch live sub counts but yeah it's just the world that we live in nowadays you get teenagers from uh, teenagers to adults i'm sure there's pewdiepie adult fans as well um they just sit and watch the sub count basically so it's been going on for a while now however the biggest potential is where the channels like flair tv as you can see here they're using that to their advantage so he's going ahead or he or she whoever runs the channel they've gone ahead and um let's click on the video right now we'll see wait for it to load let's put the music down we don't want uh, the music so basically <laughs> it's insane guys you can see the numbers right now and um that's pewdiepie on the left hand side and t-series on the right hand side and it's basically a competition for who's going to win basically and, and beat the other one currently pewdiepie is winning t-series they're catching up um they're about a, a couple of hundred thousands away basically maybe they might catch up and eventually beat pewdiepie and become you know king of youtube subscribers and whatnot but however the reason why i explained all that is so you can understand where the money lies so now this guy flair tv guy or female i don't know um has now been hosting for days now literally first of september look at the date down here first of september 2018 we are now the third of december this live stream has been running for days well weeks okay literally it's been running since for weeks upon weeks here is the crazy part it kind of it's, it's a bit mind-boggling so look at the channel views overall 90 million 90.4 million views if you're not seeing this it's because you haven't got this uh, extension plugin whatnot that shows me some information and whatnot but however he's there's 22,000 people watching right now okay and he's getting money for this he's getting paid for this hence the why it's a new method i haven't seen it being done 
by plenty of other channels yet but he's making money from this and i'm about to show you guys how to set it up so you can do it for yourself on your channel as well he's managed to get 556 subscriber uh, subscribers from this so if we do this if we copy the name of his channel and we open a new tab and we go to social blade social blade it'll be able to show us some information on this social blade let's go into it let's enter his the name of his channel paste there we go flare tv that's that's him right there and you're going to be able to see some growth okay so he's rated a grade subscribers uh ranking twenty five thousand, basically 861 and here's where it gets interesting estimated yearly earnings um from this <laughs> 104,000 to 1.7 million okay now that is estimate but uh, estimated however that, that them numbers are not far off they are not far off and if we scroll down again got it thanks okay we'll click on that and you can see some numbers um here video views one uh 1.5 million 1.9 million estimated earnings 258 to 4.1k so he's crushing it literally from these views that he's getting he's managed to rack over like literally millions of views where is it hold on let's 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 go back to it there we go he's managed to rack in millions of views as i told you 90.4 million he's literally earning thousands over 100 grand easy easy literally and per month he's only crushing it per month because this live stream is running for days and days as you can see there's a lot of people tuned in watching this is 24 7 going around the clock so he's gaining an insane amount of money the ad revenue as well will be incre increased by just crazy amount look at the likes on the video 934,000. it's insane okay so hence to why i'm about to show you guys this method so you can be able to replicate this for yourself as well okay so let's go back i'll show you another channel as well so you can see it's not just him plenty of channels are doing it alone b i haven't seen his channel or she um or her channel uh however they're doing it as well okay and people are just commenting and commenting and commenting and commenting okay so <coughs> you can do this too guys and i'm going to show you uh you guys exactly how okay the software that you're going to be able to well that's going to allow you to be able to do what these youtubers are doing is oh, i just seen another one pewdiepie fan tv so this person actually made a channel named pewdiepie fan tv and done this live um live stream because obviously they can see the, the advantage Five thousand people as well and i'm going to be showing you guys as i said how to all do all this fancy graphics and all of that and whatnot and lead you guys on the right path so you can go ahead and do it do it yourself and tell you the exact software that i use for that as well okay so the software that you're going to need is um uh, obs okay obs so if you click on any of these basically this is just telling you what obs stands for um but you just click oh I type OBSD, that's why. OBS Studio, whatever version of Mac um, you have or Windows, this should be able to work on it fine. Just make sure you download, download the Mac one or the um, Windows one, if you know, depending on which one you have. But you're going to go ahead and download OBS. It's absolutely free. You do not have to pay for it whatsoever. 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 You do not have to pay for it one bit, basically. You're spending zero penny. Okay, so you download OBS and um you go to obs so once you do everything and install obs install it and everything this is exactly what it's going to look like okay so you open it up and what you're going to be doing now is setting it up okay so let me show you guys quickly how to set this up and do this it's is way easier than you think okay so the first thing we're going to be doing is going to uh explaining obs right now guys because it's it's quite straightforward you just literally follow along with what i'm doing and you're going to be able to get it okay if not there's plenty of reaction uh reaction there's plenty of tutorial videos that you can go ahead and watch that will help you out okay so if we go to add source and you go to browser okay and then you name this so this one we're going to name it um pewdiepie for example yeah pewd 
obviously you're gonna have to spell using PewDiePie. Pewd. Pew die pie. <laughs> Pretty much. Okay. So if you add that, you name it that, okay? Um, and then you click OK. It's gonna pop up with that window. So what you want to do is guys go and find a URL of the sub count, the live sub count of PewDiePie. So I'll show you guys how to do that. So if you go back to your, to the internet, you type um, uh, PewDiePie, exactly just like that. Live sub count, it's even there in the search. If you enter that in, okay. And you go to, oh, hold on, bear me a quick second. Series um, sub count. Okay, so if you open that up, oh, hold on. Where is it? Let's look for it. Or oh, let's just do this. Sorry. Okay, PewDiePie sub count. Rather than PewDiePie versus, you know. And we should be able to find a live sub count. Okay, so there's a live uh, live sub count there. There's plenty of different websites you can use, by the way, guys. Um, uh, just to let you know, so you, you see that there's more than one. So I like the face or the graphics behind this one a lot better. So you just copy the URL, copy, and then you go back to OBS and you paste the URL right there. And what it's going to do after you press OK is it's going to populate that live sub count. Okay, and it's going to just keep on tracking it live. All right, so you click OK, and there it is. Okay, so there's PewDiePie right there. And then what you want to do, you want to do the exact same thing again and add T-Series, right? So then we go back and we press plus again, browser. Then we type on this one, we type T-Series, yeah? And then you click OK. The same thing is gonna pop up again. Then you go back to the internet and you type, um, let's just do this actually. Clever way, you can just remove this and type T-Series. And that's their one, okay? So I just typed it at the end of the URL to just speed things up a bit. And you copy and paste that as well. Copy. Then you go back to OBS and you paste it, paste it where it says URL, okay? And then you click OK. All right, it's gonna populate their one as well. Okay, so now you have it side by side and you can do some graphics right there versus um, a VS or whatever. So I'll show you guys very quickly. Um, let's add a background. Okay, so let's click and add our background. You can either add an image, guys, or you could add a color source. If you add a color source, it's just going to show you um, let's just leave as color source. You don't have to rename it. Um, uh, you can choose the color. Select color. Let's say, I don't know, we wanted blue or something. Click OK. And then uh, OK again. You drag it out to cover the page. And then what you do is you click the color source and you drag it on the bottom one. Yeah? And there's your background right there. If you do not want that background and you want something else, you can add an image. Okay, so we can go ahead and delete this. Are you sure you want to remove it? I'm just showing you guys different methods to make to spice things up and make it look a bit more appealing. Uh, uh, yeah, so let's go and go on the internet and type, um, let's just say cool, oh, cool background, cool background. PNG okay so something like that or um, cool background um, uh, cool VS let's see VS versus background so um, images okay so these are literally we live in such a great age in a, a literally amazing age you can find literally anything online so you can scroll through um, the first one that I saw that was quite nice was this one which you can use and what you guys need to look out for um and make sure um is a ps a sorry a png that would have been nice as well um we can use that however you need to find one that's you know that 
that hasn't um, got any copyright stuff on it. So you can look through, keep looking through to save time. I'm just going to use the one with the copy, the um, watermarks on it. Give me a quick second. Let's find. Is that's not too bad? This is not too bad as well, but that one is nice. Um, it's just got the watermark, the one, two, three RF watermark on it. Um, vital. Okay, this is not too bad. Um, let's see how this looks like. So we can go ahead and save image. Wait for it to load up. Save image and let's just save it as um, PewDiePie VST dash series. Okay, so what you then do is go back to OBS, press the plus button, add an image. Okay, image, um, uh, you can just leave it, you can just type VS versus, save as anything really. And then browse, and then you can go to your downloads, and um, hopefully you'll be able to find it from what you saved it as you can use whatever background you want guys as i mentioned this doesn't really matter but you can literally use whatever background um you want now the problem is just let me finding it i should have saved onto my desktop in fact it would have been a bit easier um let's see come on come on come on come on come on Okay, this is what happens when you have too many things saved onto your downloads. And I'm sure you guys have probably noticed it, but I've just skipped it. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. Okay, so you click on open. You drag this out. And um, what you do is you drag it obviously at the back and now you have that in front of you. So you can then go drag this down a bit if you wanted to um, and just position it where you want really. So you can keep it like that. You can drag them up a bit. You can leave them there. We'll drag this up so it lines up there. That, was, that doesn't look too bad. And then you can add another image there we go so you can add another image in the background as well um so now in this case in that image is fighter one versus fighter two which is pewdiepie who's number one t series number two and then they're going against each other and see which one wins okay um you can then add more fancy graphics on top and do whatever and whatnot so once you finish doing your graphics oh yeah and the tip if you stayed all the way till the end of this video i'll I'll tell you, I'll, I'll tell you, I'll, and I'll let you know what to comment down in the comment section down below. But the cookie that I wanted to show you guys, a, a very good software that I use, which is absolutely free, um, is Pixelmator. Where is it on my desktop? Pixelmator, um, it's amazing. In my opinion, it's absolutely good. I've never really had a problem with it at all. I use it for my thumbnails as well. It's quick, it's snappy, it gets the job done basically. So if you open up Pixelmator, you can, or if you download Pixelmator, if you haven't got it, it's downloaded on the internet. That's easy to do. I don't need to show you guys. And um, as you can see, if I drag it onto the screen, there that's what i used to make my um uh, thumbnails you can you can use anything basically you can get a a let's just see let's just grab for example um this or smiley face png uh, emoji in fact okay so let's say this emoji Make sure you get a PNG file, which has no background on it, and it's going to be better for you. There, okay, so that's a PNG file. You can drag this onto the software. So if you drag it onto the software, open it, it opens it up right there, and then you can take it and um, copy and paste, copy and paste it wherever you're working, and then shrink it. Yeah okay and shrink it and you can do literally whatever you want with this graphics you can 
you can create the most amazing piece of artwork in no time as you saw i just done I, you don't even have to save this delete and uh, i just dragged dragged and drop really and you